So I wanted to do a quick demonstration of where the Bugaboo B attachment adapters go. So this is our Bugaboo B and we're just getting ready to put the wheeled comfort board as you can see down there onto the Bugaboo. Now when I went into John Lewis the person who was um, there didn't know how it was adapted at all so we actually buy it from there. I wasn't sure where it went and I think I've been maybe a little bit stupid. If you actually read the instructions it does show you where the board should go. It's not completely clear I don't think but it does show you. So if you look here it shows you what you're supposed to do and I had understood that you need to take un unzip or un um, attach that lower carrier first so that's step four and step five that's pretty straightforward really but just in case you're like me and not and you're more of a visual person then I wanted to show you that first thing you do is un un unattach this area here and then these adapters actually just clip on here like that it's pretty straightforward and this one clips on here as well like that and then you just do them in and then the board will clip in here also as well so it's pretty straightforward really actually I think I've done them the wrong way around um, actually no I haven't done that the wrong way around and then it should be straightforward in terms of clipping that on there so I'll do I'll attach it more and then I'll show you exactly what you need to do so a couple of extra things to know is that you get this horrendous allen key which is only specific as far as I can tell to the bugaboo so it's not even like you know, if you ruin the screw, the, the screws, you can use any old Allen key. You have to keep this and specifically remember. So I think that's a really user unfriendly touch. And then I also found it quite useful when screwing in these screws here, using this Allen key, this dreadful Allen key, to turn the bugaboo on its side, just for ease of access. So for me, turn it on the side and then you can get in there. When you have tightened it, it should, there should be no give and also those two, that sort of fault line there, should be joined up so that it's completely tight and then it will be secure. So not great in terms of being user friendly and accessible in terms of um, being able to tighten the adapter, but that's how you do it so far.